30 seconds and you're on live. Well, they're live on my camera. Hi, we're here at the Wise Guys Show in Hailden, New Jersey, and we have live music tonight. I hope everyone's checking it out. by Jackson Brown, kind of Greg Almanish too.
if I stand all alone Will the shadows have the colors of my heart? Blue is for the tears, black for the night of God can tell by your eyes that the stars don't mean nothing, they're just a mirror. find out more about uh well you know what tommy walker does tommy walker's like everywhere <laughs> uh, I, I can't get rid of me i'm like a bad poet right this this whole night is unbelievable uh, we had mike at uh, the restaurant and um we're gonna find out what he did with federico castelluccio furio and in studio tommy walker hey, dave the pinto mike you know, Arado, you're right man no, 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 my boys and uh, jerry oh, go ahead. I, oh, I i'm gonna i'm gonna take pictures yeah, yeah, film uh, i'm filming so. we want you baby we want you <laughs> what do you if want you like mikey then i like you he's gonna sit down make you watch you observe why don't you come in inside i'm making room in the studio what did you think about their playing anton that was unbelievable that was great thank you my friend if i was getting married i'd book you guys you know I'm getting married, married. I'll cook you. Yeah. He's gonna marry the I'm chicken. I'm not getting man. married again. Chicken man. We well, got we're some getting married. I meet the chicken man. Tom, well, the the last time I, I was here, the, I, uh, my meeting of him, out of his pocket, he takes out a chicken and shows it to me. Oh, <laughs> okay. yeah. Oh, yeah. We, I'm well acquainted. I'm well acquainted. The chicken I love man from guy. Alcatraz, just so you know, I, he's yeah. a wise guy. We uh, we, well, we, we, we got some common joys. Yeah, exactly. No doubt. Don't worry. I don't load the truck anytime. He helped out. Exactly, baby. Well, go, brother. This is the first time I've seen you playing. Uh, well, not the first time I seen you playing duo. You played duo at um, I'm Crown Plaza. Crown, Crown Plaza. Plaza. Yeah, yeah, we did. We saw you. Came to see you. And uh, but I, 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 you came here. You sang solo. Yeah, yeah. Now you're doing. Now you've been. Uh, but I, you did part, do duo. Just, just, just a part of the way we do things. That we, we've been together, Dave and I. I don't even want to say how long. <laughs> This is uh this has been a long time now been and doing uh, music for many years. Michael Michael came uh, when he got out of the navy he he, he ran into our crowd and and we we got, well, I'm sorry I don't want to yeah I'm right sorry. straight directly into the market. okay and we and we were um you know we we played together for years we, we were the TK Walker band for years and what happens is you know everybody kind of finds little directions they want to you know you know I love to sing that old stuff you yeah know, yeah the Sinatra yeah. Jerry Bell all that and I do the Elvis so. Um, these guys played in the Elvis band, so so we've been yeah. we've been together for way many way more years than I want to care to admit. Well, what do you do the most though? What is there? Uh, do you I, do Elvis a lot? Well, I do Elvis a lot. We do TK Walker band. Mike had. Ha, do you get has requests a great band. for just Elvis? Though? That's what I'm saying. Oh, um, so yo, yeah, yeah, sure. You know, the phone calls come in, and, and what's good about us is we can usually answer any need. You know what I mean? Well, I need a I need a band for a 50th surprise party. I need a you know um, a 60th anniversary. You, We'll go and do it. Anything. We'll take the job. You know, if you right, need right. your car washed and your door walked, we'll we'll try to make it. <laughs> is this the biggest you go three? No, uh, no, no. We have full bands. No, six band band yeah. six, seven, six, seven, six, seven, seven people. people. It, wow. Mikey's gonna he's be a in blonde, that. He's right? Yeah. Imagine mm -hmm. now he's got a color his hair black. Yeah. Yeah. No, we I do an him. annual gig, Floral Park, 111 degrees. Oh my God. 
By the time we do the first song, I'm blonde again. It's coming down. It looks like Madeline Mann's house. Until I found the right makeup. Listen, I had I had to live and learn. You know, there was a couple of times. Why don't you get a wig? Because it looks like, you know what it looks like? It looks like who? Hey, hey, can hey, who's the guy with the wig in the room? You know what I mean? It doesn't look right. And and I got the hair for as long as I have the hair. God bless my grandfather had my grandfather had hair like this. You know, he's on the mother's side. I say you get it from there. He lived till ninety five. His hair lived to one hundred and seven. Don't rub it in. Come on. That's supposed to be a full moon tonight. No, I did That's great. Everybody's saying shave your head, shave your. Yeah, I'm afraid well, if Freddie, I, do, I, uh, I wanted to say that my, Mikey, Mikey's been been ripping up the area for the last. How, how many years was uh, Up the Dosage been playing that? Seven. Now. He wow. plays in a band called Up the Dosage. You got to see classic it. Classic rock. Uh, classic rock. Uh, they, nobody does it better. Um, they they play all around the area, same places that we do. And Mikey and I played for years together. But it was good because he he needed to get out in front. You know what I mean? And with a guy like me in the band, you know, they look well, at my. He's played in a lot of different bands, didn't you? A lot, lot of different bands. You know, he all different inceptions. You know? set on one now. Well, you know what? You, you pretty much. But you know what's a nice thing? We get to come together. How we revisit. Right. Right. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like like like. We've been playing this this whole thing, but I love when he comes out because he gives he gives the background vocals. You you heard him. He's awesome with oh, and, yeah, and he can right. sing lead, so it gives me a little relief. So you know, it's, with Eye of the Future, you, you never know what, what what's going to happen. You, you know, know each other. We know, you know where to pick up. There it is. Yeah. There it is. Well, you know? guys are related. Yeah. You guys are like related. We get that all the time. They're from the same tribe. Guys are brothers. <laughs> no, he's my father. <laughs> this guy reminds me of every cousin I've ever had. Yeah, every exactly. Yeah, right. Right. yeah, no he doubt. He told me today. He said he he looks like Uncle Fester. Uh, uh, I, I, he I, looks like Uncle Fester. You know what? We have a friend, and I swear to God, he looks like Mark. He looks like Zark. Mark. Yeah. Mark. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Mark. 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 He looks like Mark. He's a very handsome young like man. My cousin oh, Anthony he he looks Vigiano. Like... It's all <laughs> the <laughs> Anthony Vigiano. <laughs> Why do I know that? I thought you said Aunt Vigiano. I know him. You know Anthony Vigiano. Is that you? Yeah, I do. Is he? What kind of angel? Well, yeah, what time? He looks like him. That's how you know. But also, he said to me, he looks like Uncle Fester. Do you think he looks like Uncle Fester? You know what? I mean, a little bit. He's got the beard. He's got the dome. You know what's strange is we had Keith Coogan on the show tonight, and his his grandfather was Uncle Fester. Yeah, that's amazing. That's a real Uncle Fester. He was in a lot of. You were saying the Buster, um, the the old silent movies. Yeah, he was a little kid. He was so good to pull the Charlie Chaplin bathroom. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he wanted. He, remember the bulb thing? Oh, Uncle the Fester, light bulb. Yeah, he liked the light bulb. Burnt my I don't know what he was drinking. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> <laughs> that was bulb. I wonder how they did that. That was like a battery or we're, something. We're covered on their actions, but not stupidity. <laughs> 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 but Dave is my also my partner in Ace in the Hole Productions, <laughs> which we yeah, have two right. shows in Hole this week. We're doing a Lionel Richie tribute tomorrow over at the Royal Manor, about 400 people. Wow. And then we'll be at the Brownstone on Friday with uh, 300. Uh, not that far from here? No, 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 right around the, the corner. Yeah, yeah, it was kind of a cool How about thing. this guy Mallet, man? Does he play he, with you guys? Mal yeah. when, when, we, when we can have him, Mallet did a great show for us this year. Fantastic show. Um, as a matter of fact, Dawn was involved in that. But you, 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 when you look up, up a xylophone, it's the, you, you just look in the telephone book. There's only one name. There's only one. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of times they just they just well, leave. He leaves his stuff there in New Year's and comes back and does the next gig next New Year's. This guy, <laughs> I'm here for him. He's he's phenomenal. He's always been he a strong, makes, very strong support. Did you ever see him play the xylophone? <gasps> no. I wasn't here with you. Nobody back. You have it with you? Yeah. It's in his pocket. You are holding that thing? I said that to him before. That xylophone's got more, takes up more space. Oh I, I don't even think they're being oh fit. Right. Well, 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 with the well, Metropolitan. Be honest with you, Fred. I don't even know what the Metropolitan room. We had we had to clear we had to clear out half the audience. That's why I thought that's why I show you trust me. You I know what you're believe. talking about. You will not believe it. He's, he's unbelievable. Five, five time Grammy yeah, Award nominees. Another name for him. Should have won a couple of them at least. Wow. But you know what? Awesome. This is the mayor, Ray. Yeah. I'm here because, like I said, we're family. It takes a team to win a game. That's true. And that's why I said, you know what? Every once in a while, you got to put down your helmet and come yeah, over yeah, and uh, give yeah, some yeah. love. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Thank you. What was the name of your show? Good Vibes and Mambo and, Sensations. And Mambo Sensations. Yeah, that was he a knocked, great show. Knocked, knocked it out. out and it's originals. Hey, good to see you, Randy man. DiOrio, everybody. Randy. Hi, 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 Randy. Hi,
Thanks. See you soon. Randy, you're welcome to join us. You come hang out. Hey, Randy. Hey, come, come, come on, Randy. Come on. I can't say no to you guys. Just so you know, Randy came in. And just so you know, he's, he's giving me this paper. Uh, Patterson Museum honors Silk City resident Randy DiOrio. There you go. Look at that. All right, Randy. I'm the only living member inducted into the museum, right next to Luke Costello. So that was an honor. What, what, what for? Well, I was an ex-fighter. I was a sparring partner of like eight different That's world fantastic. champions. Really? Yeah, and I wrote two books, and I, I've acted with three Oscar-nominated actors That's and two awesome, Emmy Award winners. Wow. But no, the real reason why, honestly, is because a lot of people did a hundred times more great things than I did. I'm no, you know, nothing but they obviously guys. recognize you. But they recognize me because I love Patterson, right. and Patterson gave me love back. Mm -hmm. A lot of famous people come from Patterson. They say and North they say Jersey, goodbye. Jersey, Jersey, yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Lucas Stello said Patterson. And I said, Please? I say Patterson. Oh, so Patterson gave me some love. And thank you, you Freddie, for... Yeah, yeah absolutely. Thanks, thanks. Randy, my friend. Yeah. Love, yeah, love and take so you know the person make the like I hand said hand. it to you before, I just want to mention. Tonight was you. the grand opening for too. Trattoria Giotto in, uh, in uh, East Rutherford. Or I believe Rutherford or East Rutherford. Um, but they also own Blue Eyes Restaurant in Hoboken. Nice. They're right on the water. Mm -hmm. And um, they own Queen Margarita in Nutley. Mm -hmm. They have a nice outdoor uh, where they can probably play music. I'm, we're going to definitely recommend you, you to them. Nice. Tonight, we're going to yeah. go there. We're going to tell them about you guys. Yeah. I'm going to make sure you just give me some more information on no you guys. Yeah. You gave me a lot of stuff I have. But just right. give me right. something updated. Sure. And, and I guarantee you, Pasquale, who the owner, um, and Jumpin' Gennaro, who his brother-in-law, he's Jumpin' Gennaro. Is a wise guy. He's just not here tonight because okay. they're promoting this hey, restaurant. Okay. He's so in his brother-in-law <laughs> owns these restaurants, and we will get you down there. Okay, cool. We just got to probably let Mike sing in one. We well, I'd like to sing at Blue Eyes because it all depends on the shirt I wear. My eyes never heard your song. I'm <laughs> telling you, you know, it's, 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 a, it's a home That's run. Cool. It's a I, home never, run. I think it is too. And but oh, I, I haven't been anything. to this restaurant yet, but I know Blue Eyes and Queen Margarita has space for awesome. a nice band and they got a packed house. And, uh, blue eyes is on the water. I yeah, that one. You know, I love that. that. One you know, blue eyes. Blue eyes. Yeah, Hobo King. Hobo King. Where you could set your band yeah. up, and uh, Mike's played there. Mike Jump uh, Jumpin' Gennaro was in a band called Jumpin' Gennaro. Okay. And uh, but they they broke up a little bit, but. Uh, he would uh, definitely. You met Mike. He came in late. Was he? What came last? Told, came very late. Guy? Started singing with you yes, at the very yeah, end. Nice guy. Yeah, no yes. doubt. Yeah, I do he, remember him. Yes, he joined the Wise Guys and uh, his. Was in a movie, wasn't he too? Yes, yeah, the yeah, Brooklyn yeah. Bank. Right, that's right. right that's right. right. Now, nah, nah. yeah. so was, but just so you know, he remembers. With him, we're gonna we're gonna promote you guys to them, and I guarantee you, I, I, the other restaurant, I wouldn't sweat it too much because it's not as big of a, 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 a venue. work. But yeah. yeah, right. That's what I'm trying to get you there because it's I know once he sees you, you the owner of Bella Luce, he was a close friend of mine all my life, and once he yeah. sees you there for that one time, right, right, that's right, all right. I'm waiting for him yeah. to do. And uh, because they don't really do a lot of music there, they'll do it once in a while. Uh, that's why you have it. Uh, no, it's good because if, if we don't do it all that I often, we can, we'll bring them a nice crowd. Yeah. You know? <laughs> no, you're going to get work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, I promise you that last time, and I don't know what you got from the Wise Guy show, but. Now with Trattoria, Giotto, and Blue Eyes, Maybe and, and some Margarita, Pasquale will definitely book you. Hey, That's I my name. I tell him, but his he friend was, was in but Italy, can't. and they still may be. Richie Bird is still over in Italy? No, he's back. All right, he was in Italy for a while with his daughter. The next day I get a text from him, and there's other people speaking Italian on there, and then he says, Tommy, I turned on, I turned on the radio last night, and I tune in, and all of a sudden he's... Whatever, however far Italy is away, and then I got you, Tommy Walker, singing um, the Jerry Vale song. He was blown away. He was blown, I forgot to tell you about it. A lot of things have changed on Facebook. It was a lot when Facebook Live first started. It was a lot easier to get the video out there. Now they they video. What Facebook does is they chop you in half. Okay. They did it with likes. They did it with views. A lot of stuff. Right I remember there. when we first started the show, we were using all the sources for Facebook, mm -hmm. and we were getting tens of thousands of, of viewers. Sure. But Facebook cuts that in half or even less because they want you to pay. Right, you understand? They right. want yes. you to say. They want you to boost. They want you to boost. Yeah, they yeah. don't. It's actually seven percent. If, if, if they don't right, let you right. boost, if, I mean, we were boosted for free. Now, yeah. now they want you to boost. Now they want you to Yeah, I mean, we did the meatball contest in here with Joe Judice. We had like fifty thousand people viewed the video, and and since then. You see, you notice a cut. Every time, a big, huge cut. They they cut you completely because they don't want you. 
Because so they, they, they like learn. They want you to, to buy their <laughs> they, yeah. they tease you with that gotcha. in the beginning, and like they did with our, fa our Facebook Live. Mm -hmm. Now they want you to promote it <laughs> right, and right. pay for it. Do you ever do it? Because we, we with our business, we, we've had that opportunity, and we were thinking about doing it here and there. Do you ever do it? We tried it, and you know what they stop you from now? Um, if you're, like, say, now, I, I couldn't tonight, promote that. tonight's show if I wanted to. <laughs> Because they have too many logos on it. Okay. If they, they spot a logo, they'll let you go with one logo. Right. But if they see you s promoting like Armed Forces Network, S City World Radio, so That's if I promote the show, I would have to promote it and just use DDV Radio. Right. They might let it go through. Sometimes they'll they'll stop you from that. They don't want you promoting logos. Gotcha. I they want you to idea. promote what you're putting up. Yeah. I, have a great, I have a great idea. How about doing like three different posters, one logo, one different logo? We don't listen to. Taliban's. <laughs> okay, and then you give us the money and you promote it. No, I need that. Tra translate. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, Taliban. Uh, it's like, it's not like wait a minute, no, wait a minute. Are you Arabic? He's an Arabic guy. Oh, okay. I didn't know. <laughs> Taliban. <laughs> he shut the Tom, door. Tom thinks everything is Italian. I think everything is Italian. Okay. 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 We make up for it. No. Tell us about more about Ace in the Hole. Well, Ace in the Hole is Dave and I's company. We uh, we cater to traveling senior, active seniors, um, and like I said, tomorrow we'll have 400 people over the Royal Manor. It's a Lionel Richie tribute. It's an all day show. They get served lunch, six course meal. Um, uh, top of the line, I, we 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 go and we we find the, the best entertainers. We're lucky. We're blessed that way. Get a little, just a little closer. Okay. To um, we're really blessed that way in, in as much as that, you know, we have, you know, now 400 people will see this show tomorrow, right? And now you're going to, they're going to pick up, we, we put our flyers out every day. So it's just a business that by nature, you know, now they're going to want to come to the next show. And we and the shows we got coming up, I got you, I got to get you guys to come in June when we have a guy who does a Sinatra you think you think you were in a room with Sinatra? There he is. There he is. Um, <laughs> Can we get a little teaser? Strangers in the Can night. Can we get a little teaser? Come on. Come on. Okay. Just a little teaser. Right. 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 Yeah. Right. Come on. A little teaser. Unbelievable. Come on. Oh, yeah. Now. Uh, I, now. Do, I do. I do. Nell. The Frank Sinatra. Facts of life. That's why. I do. Nell. Listen. 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 Just cut the bullshit and get to it. Yeah. Show. We show it off. Right. Real fast with the condo. Everything's coming up roses. No, Judge. <laughs> no, Judge. No, come on. on. Listen. You're the facts of life. That's no. the good one. Okay. No. That's the one with the condom. <laughs> That's just beautiful. No. Hurry up. We're done with the condom, please. Oh, he wants the condom. Uh, come on, do it. Hurry yeah, up. I'm not thinking about it. Come on. Come on. Strangers, Strangers in, in the night. night. Exchanging rubbers. This one is too tight. <laughs> May I have another? This one fits just right. <laughs> 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 We won't be recommending him for the rest of the yeah. <laughs> Just on an outside chance, I'm not so sure. I'll get a job if yeah. you do things that you, you, you do a lot of uh, uh, benefits, too? We do a lot of benefits, man. We've been you involved. Do, what we do at our, 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 our company every day, we run a 50-50. Half goes to a winner in the audience. The other half goes to the American Legion that goes directly to the homeless and disabled veterans. See that? Something we've yeah. done now for the last four, four years that we've done. And let me tell you, it's amazing because tomorrow will be 400 people. The prize for the winner may be up to $600. Mm -hmm. So $600, you, you do, do the math. We, over the, over the, over the over four years, we've raised over $100,000 for wow. the veterans. That's great. That's awesome. yeah. wow. and, and what better group? The senior citizens love it. God you know what I mean? They, you know, I, they just. They, I had one lady come up to me at the show, and you know, we've had innumerable ladies, and you know, he had a 90-year-old lady come up and say, "You can never stop this," and, and you know, you 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 know, when you're busy, you're taking back. Well, what do you mean, man? We'd stop. You know, you you hope it's not something bad. And what it is basically, they're stop saying easy. you never stop entertaining us. That's why we come out. We have, you know, th these are people that lost their husbands, yeah, lost right. their family. They're living in a one room. I, I live in an area where there is a where lot of, a lot of sure. buildings. I understand, so that's why they I, love I, this. They I find they, it very. Uh, they, it's great, and and that's like I said. You guys are invited to any show you ever want to come. You know, uh, you know, like I said, tomorrow's line of Richie. Next week we have a comedy show with Uncle Floyd. Uh, greatest moments in TV. You know, TV. he's got a radio show on this network. Yeah, yeah, he, he, right. he's phenomenal. Yeah. He's phenomenal. Mm -hmm. he, he's, we're, we're, Are we're you gonna let me sing? Um, we're gonna we're gonna meet about that later. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a little side meeting. I think you should ask Uncle Floyd to listen to him first. That's yes, you're, 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 that's right. Right. yeah. No, but Uncle, Uncle Floyd's a really good guy. Uh, he's, he's a friend of the show. Yeah. Um, 
Uh, he's a very busy guy. Very he's smart. constantly doing shows right. everywhere. Mm -hmm. For his age, I, I give him a lot of credit. 300 a year. 300 I mean, a year at least. Wow. At least. Works every day. Then. How about every day? He's going to be yeah. 70 years old, 69, 70 yeah. years old. Yeah. Yeah. He was just up to play all the time, the Villa Rome. You know, yeah, that, no, he's, 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 he does across the street over here. Yeah, he's yeah, he's yeah, everywhere. Yeah, yeah, I've yeah. used them. Did you guys yeah, ever? Yeah, yeah. Did you guys them. ever check out McCones and try to get into McCones or anything? No, I, I, no, we haven't. They that's, have a place in Long Branch right? that they usually yeah, yeah. have a lot of bands. Yeah, you guys should check, check it out. Well, he lives right across the street from my brother. Who? Total Floyd. No, Wayne. Wayne. Tell me, so I'm alone. Ah, now in that show, in that show with Floyd next week, we have the girl who is the lead in Mamma Mia. For eight years, I believe. Yeah. Lead oh, mom, Mia. Um, and her name is Megan name. Dreyfus. And oh, you know that's what I'm saying. I, you know, we bought this company from people who me, boo -boo? really kind of set a nice foundation. The foundation was Marilyn and Will Roy, and um, they really set a nice foundation for us to to, have, to be well contacted. You right, know right. what I mean? And all we had to do was, you know, when we took over the company, we had to be that bridge. Mm -hmm. You know, Dave is Dave is the business guy in the company. I'm kind of like the guy who you know writes the plays and that kind of thing. And and it's a perfect partnership, you know, so it's real good. What, what, what was the most, um, like, uh, biggest uh, venue you played? Uh, biggest venue that we had? I mean, we did the Log Cabin. I always, I, it's, it's always hard for me to remember. Um, Seven Log Cabin. Maybe two, three thousand? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Did, you, did, you ever, did you ever play at the Wellmont in Montclair? No, never no, did. I've been to. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, 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 yeah. What about the, the, the landmark Jersey City? Landmark, not Jersey We did the landmark on 17. We used to do that banquet house. Um, no, Never did any of those, like, real big rooms. Yeah, well, I mean, hey, listen, we would love to. We well, listen, to. I mean, I tell everybody all the time, whenever they're doing benefits, I give out names all day long. I've said Mallet Man. Sure, yeah, yeah. I mean, you, 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 people like to know that you got their back when they're doing an event, mm -hmm, yeah. and they come to you and they ask you. But you know what it is, is most people um, that run events, they go look on their own. You know, sure, it's very yeah. rare. I wish it would, if, if, if people would have come to us first, we'd be flocking right. jobs to all Right, right. That, yeah, but sure. people usually, when they do an event, like Richie, Richie Young uh, mm -hmm. from Big Daddy Entertainment, Never, he, you know, he did the um, the freestyle event. The you know, just to get them to go up there and to do an, uh, a song that night wouldn't have been bad. You know, with, with Mallet Man. Yeah, you right, guys. Right, right, yeah, right, right, I mean, right. it would have been it would have been well, a wild, we're always wild up experience. For that. We're you know, always but, up for that. It, you know, it's just people find their own uh, artists. Sure. Their so own we, we do too. We're in that business too. You know. And but the thing is, we know people with restaurants. Right. And, right. And I tried well, to get you with my buddy. Yeah. And I, see, I thought by now my buddy would have had you there as a as a regular every week. Yeah. You know, well, you know it's it, it, it for one reason or another. You know, like I, I'm the regular at Spicy's down in the. Yeah, we, but you know, I'm talking about a, a place. For, it's only fifty people. That's what I'm yeah. saying. Don't swear. Oh, okay. Yeah. No. 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 You might be that. able to squeeze eighty, right, ninety. Right. I mean, real tight. Though. We we stay, we stay busy. We you know we're we're, we're busy all the time. He's the got Crown Plaza was unbelievable. Yeah. That that was still performing. No, that was nice. Well, well, we didn't, you know, and I don't want to badmouth anybody on the radio, but the service wasn't up to what we're used to. Right. We, you know, we were going to use them as a, a, a mm -hmm. as one of our main rooms, okay. and you know, the one night, you know, you remember, you remember. So, we, we yeah, yeah. Leave, I mean, let that it wasn't, it wasn't was it, was it that bad. Well, I mean, I've seen worse. Yeah. Um, but well, um, you were there on a good night. Oh, uh, the next time I yeah. was there, oh boy, he had a only problem minutes. I had there um, was two, two, really two. The the way the room is set, yeah, it's hard. People got to see it from a side view, right, right, right. And uh, you played in the center, and then obviously the whole restaurant goes around, mm -hmm. so you can't even sit back there unless you have TVs to it's see. It's tough. The so, ambiance was nice. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, yeah. that wasn't bad. I kind of liked yeah, it because yeah. it was the sky, you right, know? right. Um, but uh, uh, that was one problem I had, and the other problem was they served you, and never brought you. Drink. Oh, he had you were like problem, choking, yeah. and you were just dying for a glass of that's water. What, that's what really? we said. That's why we dropped out. Yeah, we I moved mean, to the Hilton. You know, the girl that was Hasper working there. Yeah, she moved. She moved to the Hilton. And our AI, you know, yeah. our girl. She's now over it. And so, uh, we, yeah, so we now did, we're doing we did an Irish show there. there. We had an Irish show there. Yeah, we're going to do a big we're show there. We're going to do a doo-wop Christmas there this year. Oh, wow. You guys do doo-wop? Oh, yeah. Well, we, we I mean, we do everything. Oh, you know, yeah. We, yeah. We, we don't tell you what, what a treat everybody. I had coming down here that I didn't expect. And what, you, know, you guys were awesome. Thanks, thanks so much. Well, tell them what you do on Wednesday nights. Wednesday nights, uh, uh, Spicy Cantina all through the summer starts June 21st. Nice. Um, we will be there. Um, I just, uh, we, that's actually me. That's the Elvis. Oh, man. Can you take a night off? Can you bring in no. some Irish guys? <laughs> no, no, I, know. I, know, I know you can't. 
Well, you we know are. what? You know what? A maybe a possible live remote. Have somebody do a live remote. Yeah, you well, know, like we like did tonight with, with Mike. Yes. Why not? Why not? Yeah. Send Jerry over this room to right? the out. Do a live remote. <laughs> guys, let me tell you how. Wait, <laughs> let's get it right. They're dissolvable. Oh, the dissolvable. Let me tell you. Let me tell you how. Let me tell you how fun that is, though. And 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 it started. You know, I started with that three years ago. And what I do is I do the early Elvis, and then I I come out and I do the you know the later Elvis. Do two sets of music, and people from flock down from Bergen County, and then drive back the same night. Sometimes it's really turned yeah. into a big thing for me. Yeah, like, so. Uh, like we're we're working on doing live remotes from other places. That's great. And if it falls on our night, we will send the wise guys or two out there. Let's do it. Let's and, do it. And I think Definitely, we got a volunteer yeah. right here. Yeah, Dawn, yeah. I'm gonna That's work why I can make sure she gets down. How this about year? the concert? The free concert? Now, oh yeah, we're gonna be at Crestkill. Crestkill, June twentieth. Doing. That, no, she should because she she'll, she'll be a great background. Singer. I gotta get your website. Um, you but we're doing in Crestkill. We're gonna do a big outdoor show uh, again. Crestkill, where's that? Crestkill is in Bergen Bur County, kind of yeah, just past Dawn Dumont, that area of Dumont. Tenafly by Tenafly. Route Seventeen. Northeast Jersey. 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 It just sounded familiar. But but it, it's a great town. It is their outdoor concert series, and we're having the Elvis Band. Mikey's involved with that. Dave's yeah. my musical director the on that. Live band. It's gonna be fantastic. That's that's the night. That's a two. Tuesday night, maybe you guys want to come out. It's one of those things where you bring out the cooler, bring out the wine, everybody comes, the whole community comes, and it's really a it's a really a great night. And I got yeah, a, that would be fun. I got that'd a sound good. system that's that, that that's coming in for that show. But it's, it's every Wednesday night though. No, that's no, Tuesday. No, that's Tuesday. no that, yeah, oh, the right. next night is when I started right, spicy. Right, right, right. But it, give me one second. I just want to just I, I got to plug Mikey. Mikey has been uh, involved with up the dosage for a while, okay. right? Now he's just started a new band. They call it CRS. Okay. Which you know is. Code word for can't remember. Shit. Can't remember. Shit. Can't remember shit. shit. But it's it's a great Poo -poo. band. Him, I probably uh, should. Elena that, McLaughlin, <laughs> Joe McLaughlin. They're starting a new band, and I also want to plug. Dave is involved with a, a band called Dave's Not Here. Mm. So do you ever see well, any of these guys two names? Named Dave. Yeah. In the band. Well, where yeah. are you? Wait, so wait a minute. You you're all in separate bands, but playing the one band. We 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 do we yeah. do every, we 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 do this so we stay busy. As much as we can. They multitask. Are you all friends, like bands and all, all of us? Right. All of us. We have such a strong musical community. It's, it's good unbelievable. Idea, yeah. wow. Like Mal was saying. Parties. That's the support. The Z Carries. You know all these great bands that are out there. Um, you know, I mean, we go with the Un Brothers. The Un Brothers are a fantastic band. They call themselves the most yeah. unusual. Uh, co Uncover band you've ever seen. These guys take things, go in from a, a Bee Gees song into Metallica, uh, oh, wow. Soundman, yeah. into Mr. S you know, out of, out of Enter Sandman into Boom, 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 oh, wow. Boom, Boom. Yeah. Yeah. And then we had those guys. guys. I don't like yeah. that because I like all yeah. music. Dude, yeah, dude, yeah, you would love this. I know we've talked about what you like. I'm a big Metallica fan and I'm a big You got to go see this because you're going to want to have them on your show. And we're all into like two guys who sang. You were here about the Umbrellas over in the Dave's Not Here. We're just dead. Yeah. So the Bronx the yeah, drummer, cool and Tommy yeah, cool have another band called Shave, Shave Ham. Ham, which is a very cool successful mm -hmm. band. We just yeah, TK Walker band. That's really and, cool. And, and you know what? All is? part of Ace yeah. in the Hole. Uh, no, but with uh, a lot of them have worked for Ace in the Hole. Yeah. Oh, okay. and, you know, Ace in the Hole specialty is the senior luncheon. The shows. senior luncheon. Right, right, right. Yeah. You know, we're going about twenty-seven years. This is our twenty. We get a lot of reference oh, work. Wow. Tommy and I. This is our fifth year. Yeah, wow. Fifth year in the business as owners. And, uh, and Dave a, thinks he's retiring in two years, but I got I got different plans. We're building the business into a multi-million dollar business, so we can't leave. Now you just can't leave. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. No, 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 no. We'll tell you what uh, you, when you, you when you can retire. Teach. I'm on. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 Johnny. Drinks are on the house. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's my, one of my favorite movies. Oh, yeah, That's yeah, great. Yeah. That's my great. favorite movie. That was, about, that was my favorite line, though. Yeah. Oh, Cheech! Yeah, yeah. Have I? <laughs> <laughs> That's what that was from. That was from the guy. Remember when he went to talk about the Rosado Brothers? The Rosado Brothers! And oh, yeah. Like, you came in and he goes, like, All right. I know. I got enough of I mean, your father got along with it. I don't say nothing out the night. I go, Cheech! I lied! <laughs> I remember, yeah, I remember, remember that yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> I like to remember when he was in the courtroom. Oh, you mean I was in the olive oil business with his father? Yeah. <laughs> 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 what a great um, So what do you have... Um, that you're working on for the future. Um, is it, you know, are you just combining this big, or like you just well, no, said, no, no, you know what? When, when, thi when, when things, yeah, well, I'm hoping. Um, but when, you know, when things, when things uh, present themselves to us, 
we can go, all right, well, this that band's perfect for that. Like, we, we, we've been called, you know, recently. Do you just take on other bands? Um, well, you know, if we can get them work or somebody, you know, like I saw a band one night. Because we have an some... official band here that they're, they're, they, I, they, they, I do good, want to do right? a special mention, too, by the way. They per, they performed that, um, uh, how fun. They performed, they got to find out what they want to right? There was a band here playing once that I saw sure. on one of the Graffiti shows. Cannon? Yeah. I think it was. Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's that's how young, young guys. Yes. Yeah. 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 Here we go. Cannon. Graffiti Cannon, Chris Tataro, Rick Fabio, and the boys, who I heard perform, because we couldn't make it because we had to do the freestyle lupus event. Right. That was a really a lupus event uh, benefit. Uh, Graffiti Cannon, Chris Tataro, and Rick Fabio, and the boys, who I heard perform spectacularly at, at the food and truck um, and craft beer festivals at um, uh, Skyline Stadium. You've ever played yeah. there? Uh, no, no. Skyline Stadium. And uh, I heard the interview of them on the radio. Mm -hmm. they, they sent it to me, and it sounded great. I mean, it was like a live, in, live radio interview, and um, they talked. They had them live talking about what they were doing. The food trucks were coming. There was over 20 food trucks. Wow. That's, over, that's a big event that's because big I've been to an event with big. maybe ten food trucks and that's big. I, we couldn't get close to one of those events. We 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 started to come out. We left too late. They the, the they were turning us away because I mean they're very popular. These well, you'd be surprised here in the Wise Guys show the bands that have come in and out of here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not mentioning Mallet Man over there, mm -hmm. but we've had Bob Levy's son come in here. We've had uh, obviously Graffiti Cannon. We've had um, Cool Change. Cool Change. Cool the, the, yeah. They sang Doo Wop. They, they oh, were the original yeah, I saw them. That was good. That, that was great, too. Yes. Unbelievable. Yes, Unbelievable. yes, yes. Then we had um, Inner uh, Gypsy. We've had American um, Nomad. American Nomad. I mean, we've had bands come in and out of here. And to um, and Graffiti Cannon has been the best for us uh, because uh, they do our theme song. Yeah, yeah. That, oh, that was them. That's yeah, great. So they, yeah, yeah. they just came yeah. out of nowhere. That's right up your song. line, that music, too. That's that. Well, music. I mean, I like Yeah, no, I know you do. I know you do. But that's a little. And and I give every all music a chance. Some music I just I'm not into, right. but mm -hmm. um, I'll still give it a chance, you know. And uh, like even elevator music, you know, and it's, it's a cool rhythm. I like it, you know. Yeah. And and I like all music, so there's not from A to Z, and from classical to heavy has the raw heavy metal uh, as it gets. Like, I, I, my favorite, my favorite singers were Ozzy and and Pavarotti. Yeah, yeah. But now talk about an extreme. Now, now anything in between, I like to, you know. what I mean, so. I, <laughs> so can you play one more song? <laughs> I no, no, we're to. gonna let them play a little oh, okay. more. Okay, all right. I want to, I want to time it right because I want you to close the show you off with it. us. We, we technically have um, 15 minutes, Jacob. Is Jacob there? Jacob. Uh, uh, Jacob. Jacob. He hasn't been there. Is he there? What's up, Anthony? <laughs> oh, hey, Jacob's what's up, guys? Face. I'm just <laughs> hanging out of the window. We have here. like 15 minutes left, and how long, Jacob? How long do we have? <laughs> oh, call Jacob for me, please. Uh, he's not here. He's outside, he's I think. Oh. Is it, can you see if he's outside? I, I just want to. No, I want to time it right because we're going to play these to finish off the show. The show. Um, uh, you're going to finish with two songs. Yeah, sure. Are Maybe you okay you with are. that? I love it. Yeah. I love what, it. What time is the two songs? Uh, a combination about about six minutes. Six so minutes each? No, 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 no. We could. We'll do. Uh, we'll do House of Pucona and um, in the other night. Okay. All right. Okay. So in four minutes, we'll close off the show and uh, actually. Um, before you leave, I want to. Uh, uh, is there any websites you want to promote and, and get um, out there? Ace and All Productions. Ace Shows dot com. All right. That's Ace the, that's the Shows dot com. com. That is uh, the website for the Ace and the Hole Productions. You'll see on that. You'll see our 2017 schedule. Every f every show we do is on there. The fly the actual flyer. The, you know, is in a row. You see the menus. You see what times. To start, the venues, the Brownstone, the Royal Manor, the mm -hmm. Hilton, Comedians. the Stony Hill, and what comedian is on the show. So you'll be able to get our full entire schedule on aceshows.com. Aceshows.com. Right. Is there a, just a phone number, too? I mean, or sure. There certainly is. You want to give us a phone you, number? Did, you ever get, did he ever give you a card? Yeah, I have him. I'm just saying. <laughs> I, 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 That's a sore point. Everything's him. in. Um, I got a card for everybody else there's, but my own business. There's a phone number. Please give that out. Okay. And you can keep that card. Too. Jerry, give this to Freddie to look at. 
Yeah. And now I'm going to go. Jerry, you want to read the phone number? No. I'm like, Lish. I can't. I really can't see. The phone number is. It's Ace in the Hole Productions. The phone number is. There's a bunch of them. You got a. The toll free number. Yeah. Yeah. All right. That's one eight hundred eight three one nine eight zero one. And Good. Then, yeah, and then the other one is okay. two zero one. Yeah, the other one. Oh, the office number yeah. is two zero one three seven four two three three three. Let the me see that business card. The bonus with and that, you're not going to be able to our here, office number. To you get to talk to Vicky, who's who's the best, and Debbie. She we're takes give the a shout out. Debbie, okay. Vicky, and Martha. We love y'all. So All make right. some reservations. Well, Tommy Walker, yes. Dave DePinto, Mike Honorado. We want to thank you for coming. Yeah. 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 Off the show, but before they close off the show, you should go start getting ready. We're gonna. We got. I want to know. One thing I do. I do want to know when you guys got this million dollar Right now, we had to mention. Boom! We're Right. We got to do a special announcement. Uh, we were asked by Frank Giganti. My Way Productions and the Hoboken Historical Museum presents the screening of an anti-bullying short docu-fiction, Breaking the Silence. Tomorrow at 7 p.m., a special performance by violinist Anna Mancini will be there. Please check out BreakingTheSilenceFilm.com for more information. But get out to Hoboken. Um, Q and A's will be following the screening and free admission and free parking. So get out there May 11th tomorrow at 7:30 p.m. for breaking the silence of my way. Um, next week, let's real quick. Next week we got Ray Burris coming into the uh, calling into the studio, and we have um, Billy Staples. Billy Staples coming in, coming into the studio, and, and Frank Fleming, the Met super fan. The wow. Met super duper fan. <laughs> He's be coming in, but um, we want to thank tonight. Uh, um, Home Security Consultant LLC.com, Home Security um, Consultant LLC.com, Sean Starry, the owner and the consultant. Check him out at 125 North Wilbur Avenue in Freeport, Illinois. Go email him at Sean Starry at Home Security Consultant.com. Call him at 1 at 815-238-3005. Again, that's 815 815- Two three eight three zero zero five. Sean Starry will make your home safe. Give him a call. And we want to thank everybody for coming in tonight. We want to thank Keith Hogan and apologize for all the uh, technical difficulties. But again, future shows, we got Stanley Livingston, Chip Douglas, the original Chip Douglas. We got Richard Grieco, that Red Jerry the plumber took care of us. Uh, Carl uh, Gottlieb, uh, the screenwriter for Jaws. Also, Susan Backlean, Backlini, um, from the, the first from victim. Jaws. What? The first victim. She was the That's first right. victim on the beach. Animal House, Mark Metcalf, Niedermeyer will be coming in on June 28th. And Martha Smith, who was known as Babs. And listen, we thanks to Steve Joyner, we are very close to getting... Um, Flounder from Animal House. We're very close. So, so we're working on a lot of stuff. Don't forget Levy Live on Tuesdays. Don't forget Matt Scale also on the 28th. Matt Scale, Barney Miller, Detective Wojo Hoax. And, um, and uh, De- another one that Jerry got, uh, Delia Shepard. She was uh, the um, the girlfriend in uh, uh, Rocky Five, the Tommy Morrison. Don't forget Levy Live. Curtain Call with Steve Joyner. Check it out. And also... Uh, Uncle Floyd Radio on Mondays. Following and it's Uncle Floyd, we got um, uh, Levy Live and the Wise Guys Show, and then Curtin. I'm telling you, it's a great event. Thank you everybody for calling in. Hey. Thank you for listening. Thank you for Facebook Live. This yet. is the Wise Guys Show on. But we're not done yet. <laughs> oh yeah, we're not done yet. But we want to thank you. We want to thank you, everybody from DDVRadio.com, DDV Radio, tune in. On Forces Radio Network, Village Connection Radio Network, Mal and Man Taylor on the back, and we want to thank you, Village Connection Radio, for letting us air our show, and City World Radio. This is the Wise Guy Show. We'll be back next week, but right now, Clark Wolf will be Tommy Walker. Thank you very much. Hey. This, this is about the bear.
on his nose. He can't be asking help and he finds him from there. No one knows where he goes. I stand up to that love yeah, I who said have a look to the jar from the nose of a bear. So with me if he can I've got there. Back to the house and we'll call about one. Now you see surprise that's so no,